<laughs> hey guys, how's everybody doing? Corey here from Mixing It Up Outdoors. Hey, I just wanted to do a real quick report. I'm out here today on Lake Winnebago. Um, today is Monday the 9th, and uh, I just wanted to come out and check a few things out, check how the cracks were working and all that stuff. Um, all the shacks, as you know, have to be off the ice now. The permanents have to be pulled off at the end of each day. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to come out here and check everything out. So what I'm seeing is in by the landing, there's water on the ice, as you would expect from this heat and stuff. Um, the heaves did push up in areas. I heard of a car going through yesterday. I'm not sure where out here, but I did hear of one going in. I'm not sure if that was just a rumor or not. But uh, it's winding down real quick here. Um, the bridges are still out off of Merritt Street. Um, there's reports of some of the other clubs pulling their bridges and their tree lines and everything off already. Um, I haven't got a definite word on that, but I, I did hear of that, so it's probably going on from the person I heard it from. Um, other than that, I just want to kind of come out here and show you guys what's been going on. Now, the, the ice, the top layer, we're about two miles out maybe, mile and a half to two miles out right now off of Merritt Street. And the top layer, I can take my shoe, and if I grind, I can get down about an inch and a half. So the top layer is, is getting pretty soft. I'm going to drill a hole here real quick and uh, see. But coming out there with some softer spots, you know, some slush pockets. Watch out for around... Um, Sturgeon holes, anywhere where there's ice drifts, where there's water sitting on the ice, that water will funnel. So just be cautious if you're going to be out here. As far as uh, vehicle travel, personally, uh, after today, no. For me, um, I have a family at home and, and it's not going to happen for me. Smaller lakes I'll be out on, but as far as like Winnebago, even Poygan. I was out on Poygan yesterday and... Uh, the road, the main road that they have going straight off in Nofkeys, they actually have closed off. There was a lot of water in that. I drove through it with my four-wheeler, and there was a ton of water in there. Um, there's a couple, you know, the side roads that go off of that, but but even those are pretty shaky. There was a lot more water on Poygan than there is out here on Bagel. But uh, as far as the bigger lakes, you know, I think as far as vehicle travel, I'm 100% done. Four-wheeler, possibly, but chances are it's not going to happen. So uh, if you do decide to come out and, you know, if it's worth it to you, that's your choice. But um, please be cautious and, you know, watch what you're doing. Watch for those holes and those water spots and all that good stuff. Um, I'm going to fire this drill up and drill a hole here and show you how soft the ice is. And then I'll do a quick video and I'll drive around a little bit and show you what the ice looks like. Show you what a couple of the heaves look like. Show you what the bridges look like and all that good stuff. Okay guys, so as you can see from that hole being drilled, the top few inches are a little soft, but not too bad. Um, I would say the top inch and a half to two inches is super soft, but past that, it's just looking at it in the slush pocket, you can see about that deep is kind of slushier, and then the rest is good clear ice. Um, so there, I mean, there is a lot of ice out here. It's just with these warm temperatures, water on the ice, and you get that wind moving, that water, it's gonna go quick. Especially this week, they're calling for like, high 40s, mid 50s or something like that, um, she's going to go. So I'm going to take a quick ride here on the lake and uh, film some stuff. And then, uh, like I said, until, until next time, I'll see you guys later.
enough for me on that one. All right, guys, so there you have it. We just took a real quick ride around Winnebago, filmed some of the cracks, filmed a couple of the bridges. There's a couple bridges that the heaves pushed up in the air and actually twisted now. Um, the one straight off of Merritt Street is like that. There's two bridges there. One you can get over, one you can't. Um, the one to the south, or the two to the south, one you can get over, the other one you might be able to, but it, uh, you can see by the video, it just wasn't happening for me. But, um, and then the cracks, you know, stay away from that stuff. I filmed a couple slush pockets going through them. Um, right now, you know, they're, they're okay. I picked, I picked the pretty shallow ones, but there was a couple that we, I walked out into that were pretty deep. So just use caution, use common sense when you're out here um, and, and, you know, be safe. So yeah, like I said, guys, I'll just see you guys next time and hopefully I'll come out with some more videos here shortly and uh, get out on some open water. Really looking forward to um, Voyager and stuff opening up. Get out there and get some of them walleyes. Um, but, but please, 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 please be safe. All right? Enjoy.